from NCIS Los Angeles, which you can watch on CBS's uh, Monday night lineup at 10 p.m. Eastern time. Eric Olson, good to see you, sir. Thank you so much for having me. I appreciate I'm it. pleased to have you here. What a beautiful set. Thank you, sir. You guys are crushing it here. We are trying to. You're doing very well. Well, I'm trying. You know, we got all sorts of knickknacks that are around here. But they're good knickknacks. Thank you, sir. Yeah. I appreciate that. So you're an Iowan, correct? You're from that great state uh, of Iowa yeah, that brought us I, Kurt uh, Warner and so many I other great... I brought you items. Kurt Warner, mm -hmm. and uh, I'm in an interesting place because around me, you're either... It's equidistance to Chicago, Minnesota, and Green Bay, so everyone around me has to kind of pick their team. And what have you chosen? Well, I did something interesting. I'm kind of a polygamist, so I've, I've chosen to love <laughs> two, two beautiful girls, which are the Vikings and, uh, and Green Bay, which kind of works out for me overall. Because well, well, for Brett Favre and Greg Jennings, many, but that is a flagrant violation of all things that, that are Favre right in the national football. The year that came to the Vikings league. was the best year of my life. Uh -huh. That was the happiest year ever. But all, all I know is, is really that I that I hate the Bears. So watching that game last night brought me great joy. Yeah. And to the point that I and then I got kind of sad. Because uh, I have color on one of my fantasy teams. And, uh, well, you haven't put him in the lineup for a while, I imagine. Uh, right? I actually had to because I had a bye week for um, my QB. So I Which is, who's your, who's your normal quarterback in your fantasy um, league? Well, I have three, and that one You can't was, even keep it straight, can you? I can't. It was... Uh, Speaking of being a polygamist, oh you can't even figure this out. Well, that's the problem, is that we, we join these leagues, and I'm doing this, this wonderful league for CBS that's, that's uh, online where everyone can see it. And then when you fail, you fail on the grandest of scales. It's not like you and your buddies. It's not you and your work friends. It's right. like for everyone to see, and I think I'm f I'm going to be five and five in that. You're going to be the f so which, but you know, there's one that you want to win more than another, correct? Well, I, mean, I think that as a competitive person, I want to win all of them. Okay, but that's just not going to happen. That's not in the cards for me. And I drafted AP uh, as my first round draft pick in two. In two of the in three. Two of those three. And huh. Calvin was my other first round draft pick. And he's had a, a first half of the season that yeah. is lacking, certainly in the statistic department. Yeah. Do you have any idea when AP is coming back? I don't. I, I the, if I had to guess though. It would be in December That's that that the saying. league is going to go through a process here with him, even though the Players Association is going to potentially sue to get him back in sooner. Right. Justifiably so. Well, I mean, the league is going to go through whatever they feel its due diligence needs to be on right. this front. And they're probably going to have to make an example of him. Well, th there are some out there who believe he should be made an example of yeah. that what has even happened to him over the last two and a half three months that that is it's something that's richly deserved there's yeah. a large group of football yeah. fans out there yes. yes and there are some who are screaming at their radios or televisions right now that think it's very unfair that he's still out right they now. all have him in their fantasy league many of them do and they're biased fact, based or on or picked position. him up over the last couple of weeks when they heard the the rumor that he's going to be back I did on in my third you did that. So I have them in all three now. Eric Christian Olsen of NCIS Los Angeles is here. So Aisha Tyler is in that league, right? Yeah, I played Aisha this past week, and I, and I beat her because uh, I played Justin uh, for, for Baltimore. He okay. Two big touchdowns for me. And Jordy Nelson. Okay. Uh, who else is in the league? Lucas Black, who, who's the, the great Lewis golfer. Bl okay. Uh, Emily from NCIS. Uh -huh. uh, J.B. Smooth, you know him? J.B. Smooth, he's, he's of course. Jam. Kevin Chapman. It's all people from CBS shows. Uh -huh. So it's we're, we're up there on online, and I started off I think with four losses. So, so you started zero and four, yeah. and you're in this mix now. Yeah. Okay. I'm run for it. This will bring me to tonight. Five five. Tonight, um, I've got a couple of guys going. I've got Kelvin Benjamin and, and Darren Sproles. How I'm much? seven points down against the the Philly defense. What do you think? I think you're fine. Yeah. Uh, you think I'm? Up, you think I'm in the? You think I'm in the clear? Do you think I'm in the clear? As an Eagles fan, I'm going to say he's in the clear because I don't think it's going to happen. Right. But uh, as we discussed earlier, too, they did lose to Miko Ryan. So there's always a chance. You get the double up touchdowns, you could be there. Right. I'm rooting for a shootout, too, because I'm going against the Eagles D. Huh. And I have Jordan Matthews up one. Interesting. I, I think Aisha has Shady and Sanchez, but I'm up by 47 points. But that's, wait a minute, hold Ooh. on a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You left Ooh. out some crucial info. You said I beat. Aisha Tyler, oh, as if it done. is done. It's done. But you, wait, <laughs> so you have no more. You have no more ability to accrue points, right? I got You're nothing. done. I got nothing. But 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 hold on a minute. <laughs> so so he, he she's got shady. And she and has Sanchez. Sanchez. It's gonna be close, dude. You got yourself a nail biter tonight, Eric. PPR? No. Just straight okay. up. Straight yes. up. Now in this Which CBS, me, yeah. In this CBS league, do you all have to? Uh, lose to Les Moonves on purpose? He's or? not in the league. What's up I, they, with that? It's 95, you said it, you're 95% luck? Because yeah. I've been crushing it for the last four years, knowing that it was luck. And this year, now that I'm losing, now you're it's completely true that it's, I mean, it's, it's. I, I went through the, the. you know, I used every site I could. I looked at all your stuff, I looked at, I went online, did the whole thing. Mm -hmm. And the two people that it said were gonna win 
based on on drafting was me and my buddy, and now we're you know right. We're both uh, struggling to get to. So uh, Chris O'Donnell and LL Cool J on L this program. LL's not in it. Chris is in it. He's uh, I think he's right at 500 too. Okay, so O'Donnell's in this fantasy this is happening. League. Says LL Cool J too cool for 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 this? Is that uh, what you're saying? I don't know why he's not Let's in it. Let's create an NCIS Los Angeles. Uh, I think hissy probably figure. next year. I'll call him out and say that next year he's probably. Gonna I have think to we do should it. do that. Um, Monday's 10 p.m. Eastern. Congrats on, Thank you so on the much. show. Congrats it's, it's on yours. Up. We've been I've been listening to the podcast for you were on for what four years? Yes. Um, Thank and you. When you made the change over to here, I was very excited. I appreciate you saying yeah, that. It's awesome. Thank you. And it's a and it's a beautiful set. You guys keep up the good work. Thank you. Thanks, dude. You, you please come back. No, please come back. My pleasure. And let us know how Aisha. Uh, it's done. Came it's back a win. From your, I mean, oh, it's, it's gonna be. I'm gonna call over. in tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. Just crying if that happens. I just can't see. No, I can't. I gotta think you're positive, probably, man. You're probably lucky that she's on the talk right now, not hearing this kind. I'm sure she is. I'm sure she's following my Instagram, yeah. going. He's he's gonna. He's a liar. He's a liar. Good to see you, Eric Christian Olson. Please. Please watch him on NCIS Los Angeles, Mondays, 10 p.m. Eastern on CBS America's Most Watched Network. Good to see you, Thank sir. Thank you so much. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern. On Audience.